All right, guys, we're back for another Dokkan battle video, and uh-oh, 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 do we have the big guns here. Today, we're going to be looking at the brand new LR Gogeta from what the... I, I saw a couple of his animations briefly. To me, it looks like this unit probably has the best animations in the game. LR transforming SDR base form Gogeta. And then, of course, we also have his transformed form. I just figured for these, whatever. We're, we're just going to start the battle with, with one. And then we also got the other one. So, these Vegito and Gogeta units, they're definitely a little bit wonky, right? Um, in that, like, you know, like, before they transform their stacking attack, uh, you know, they don't get a lot of key. So, like, you are going to want to build their links, like, like, in a very proper manner here. Um, okay, okay, okay. So, this is Gogeta, right? Attack and defense, 77%. And then he builds up key and attack and defense when he supers. Effective against all types as first or second attacker in a turn. Ridiculous. A guaranteed super attack and high chance to evade as a third attacker in a turn. Just, like, a stupidity how ridiculous these guys are um okay so we're gonna do this right here yeah this is what we're doing and we're gonna get okay so this is turn one blue gogeta which i guess you know this is not possible but here we go turn one blue gogeta this is gonna be pretty good right here <laughs> we got him linked up with super saiyan gogeta um i believe with transformed blue gogeta they'll have all but one link i believe well, no, Transform Blue Gogeta doesn't have Kamehameha either. Um, he doesn't have Kamehameha or, or Legendary Power. Okay, please stop. Y listen. <laughs> we d yeah, you're good. You're good, but you could go away. We're looking at others. There's others we need to see right here. Relax. Relax, Gogeta. Okay, okay. So here we go. Here's the big boy. 3.7. Oh, his attack stats all the way at the top of the screen like Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta. It's, it's literally just a scene from the movie. Yes. <laughs> It's literally just the scene from the movie right there. Like, that's insane. Just, like, okay, here you go. <laughs> here's the scene from the movie. Have fun with that. <laughs> All right, so here's actual Gogeta himself. Um, what's his defense? Sir, 98K. Okay, that is with uh, LR Great Saiyan 1 and 2, right? 98K. 70% defense at the start of turn. Uh, additional with medium chance of being a super... And a high chance to evade enemy attacks as a third attacker in a turn. Then he transforms at on turn four, right? Both Vegito and Gogeta transform on turn four. Um, okay. So I'm gonna do this. We're gonna put Great Saiyan Man one and two in this. No, 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 no. I'm gonna put Super Saiyan Gogeta in this first turn. I'm gonna keep him linked up with this STR Gogeta. I guess the one thing to keep in mind. Oh, his key is really good. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay. I think Gogeta. Uh, it's hard to say because they're both on so many teams, right? I was going to say Gogeta will probably be better off with Lynx. Let's see. Last Resort, Fusion, Realm of Gods, Movie Hero, Kamehameha, Transformation Boost. There's like full over and a flash on all those teams. Let me look at Vegito. Patara is a little bit rougher. You're going to have to use Tech Vegito Blue or Physical Vegito Blue. Um, I'm you know, I'm not the biggest fan of them over like LR Vegito Blue. 2.58 turn one. Mm. Oh. The animations are just so crazy. Now, remember, again, he does stack attack every super attack, right? So, like, every single super attack, he is getting stronger and stronger in his base form. But then, once they actually fully transform into blue, then the attack and offensive buffs only last for one turn. So, that, that's an important thing to remember. Um. Okay, so Vegito's categories. Patara, Realm of Gods, Time Traveler, Future, Kamehameha, and Transformation Boost. I feel like... Gogeta's... Okay, we're going to have his... No, no, no. We can... Okay, okay. We can't do Gogeta's active skill yet. The reason is because in order to do the active skill, the enemy has to be below 50% HP. So, uh, we saw this recently from Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta and the Angel Super Saiyan 3 Goku, right? Where their animation or their transformations were obtained uh, when the enemy has a certain HP threshold, right? So that is an important thing to sort of consider right there. Um, okay, wh what are we going to get right here? 3.23. Okay. Now, remember, they do build up continuously, right? Like, they get 7% attack and defense with every uh, attack they do. Wait, wait, is it attack or is it super attack? Let me see here. It's... Oh, you know what? Gogeta... Okay, so it's when attacking an enemy. 
Gogeta, his second attack is a guaranteed additional normal. It's not even... Hmm. So Vegito is able to do double supers like that, whereas Gogeta gets the super attack, and then he also has the normal... Hmm, so I think I like Vegito better just based off of the guaranteed second super attack he could do, right? Like, I, I think that's going to be a little bit better suited for him. Oh, man, that's tough. Hmm. Okay, what, what is Gogeta going to get right here? Three oh, that's very good. That's very good considering he hasn't built up that 7% attack and defense at all, and then it just goes up and up and up. And he's super effective against all types. Yeah, they're insane. They're so good. And, like... Their defense doesn't look as impressive as it actually is, right? Like, because, well, I mean, Vegito's doing multiple guaranteed supers per turn, so he's getting multiple guaranteed defensive raises per turn. SDR Gogeta is not, though, because he's not getting guaranteed super attacks. Oh, that's rough. Hmm, I think I like Vegito better. I think Vegito is better, just based off of this initial look right here. I think Vegito is better, because... Having the, a, a second guaranteed super attack is just, like, uh, that's so damn important. Having that second guaranteed super attack like that. Like, you're not, you can't discount, discredit that or discount that. Nothing like that. Okay. 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 All right. Gogeta. What, what can you give us right here? Okay. So, he goes up to four mil. Four million super effective against all types. And then 400k with a crit on a normal right there. Again, he do, we do have to still keep building up the attack and defense for him. Um, every single attack he does. Now, Gogeta does do a guaranteed super. And he gets a high chance to evade if he's the third attacker in the turn. Hmm. Okay, we, we can go ahead and use the full force Kamehameha right here. Um, I guess we'll go ahead and bust it out. There's no reason not to. Um, this, of course, would activate, I believe, uh, their 7% attack and defensive increase as well. So here we go. Here's the full force Kamehameha. I believe Gresh translated it as the ultimate Kamehameha. This is insane. This is, I think, the single best animation in the game right here. Gogeta, his active skill is like that is so it's literally like the scene from the movie. That is so insane. Wow. Wow. <laughs> And then they had these, oh my goodness. The little ending animations that both Vegito and Gogeta have is nuts. Oh. <laughs> okay. All right. Here's a really good turn for SCR Gogeta, right? Because we've got the movie hero support Gohan. We have blue Gogeta. Um, uh, you know, so, so most of the links are going to be active right here. Uh, let's see what we can do. Is that an 18 key super attack? It's not. Let me go ahead... Now, I'm, I'm going to save the shoes. I'm, I'm going to save the shoe items for now. We're just going to go ahead and rock this as is. Because he does raise attack and defense on one turn anyway. So, it's not like his 12 key super attack is going to be that unimpressive, right? This, on like a difficult event, is a ridiculous rotation, by the way. So, blue Gogeta guaranteed crits right here. 2.87 million. And then we have the second blue Gogeta with his super effective against all types. And he's going to be at like 4 million on a 12 key or something like that. Or whatever he can do. So there he's at 5.16. Wow. <laughs> Are they better than Kale and Khalif? They might be. I okay, I, I have to see more of them. I, 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 I it is a little bit too early for me to say for sure. But I do think Gogeta and Vegito might be better than Kale and Kali. They might be. They might be the best units in the game. I think so. I think they actually did it. They actually made units better. I think so. All right. So this Gogeta, I think, is close to having his max attack and defense built up. 115k. Remember, Vegito is definitely going to be a better defensive unit than Gogeta because, I mean, unless you have him in the third slot, right? So, like, if we did this, Gogeta at the end... Not only would he raise his defense before he's super attacking, but then he would also have the 50% dodge chance, which would be huge, right? Hmm. Okay, I'm going to put Gogeta right here. Um, I want to see how how he's going to fare right there in front of this tech 
Goku. Although I, I, I think he's only going to take double digits. He would take damage if he got super attacked. Um, but that's it. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. So for difficult events, like the UI Goku event right here and stuff, they they are good enough because they'll take damage from uh, an int UI Goku super attack, but they're not going to take damage from normal attacks. Um, now, obviously, the dodging, which it would be really helpful, we can't use against int UI Goku, right? So they're definitely not the best units in the game for the legendary Goku event. There's no doubt about that, that I would say. Um, like, Kale and Khalif are definitely still better. EGL Gohan is better in the legendary uh, Goku event here. Okay, so I th I'm gonna put Blue Gogeta right there first. Uh, Blue, yeah. So, so yeah. Okay. So he, see, here's what's unfortunate. As good as this Vegito and Gogeta are, they're not like dominant, insurmountable like presences here, right? I couldn't just put Gogeta in this first slot and said, no matter what happens, happens. We're good, because that would not be the case, right? So that is a little bit of a negative. I mean, again, it's Kale and Khalifa. They're oh that was not the way I wanted that to work out. Uh, Kale and Khalifa, it's not like they're the best unit in the game instantly from turn one or anything like that anyway, right? They do still need to build up as well. Okay, okay. So Gogeta, this Gogeta is taking 11k right there from normals with a 50% chance to dodge. Man, these units are fun. And they're on so many different team, teams too. And like because of how much stronger they get, like in the third slot of the rotation like you really could bring them okay nice dodge gogeta you really can bring them and just have them like bust out their dodges and stuff like that right like or uh, 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 wow <laughs> okay what is this uh, well, let's just see the damage he's gonna do right here okay a three million crit super effective against all types wow um for str gogeta he doesn't gain super effective against all types until after he transforms on turn four, by the way. So giving him crits is not actually a waste. Um, that's something to consider as well. Okay, perfect. I'm going to go ahead and pop another heal right here. Um, no way. I don't think the AGL Blue Gogeta will finish this off. And then we're going to get the full key right here. So this is going to be a very high attack stat for Blue Gogeta right here with this Gohan right here as well. You know, the 40% movie hero Gohan. I should have used a shoe item. 2.66 by this blue Gogeta. If he gets a double super attack, I think Goku is actually dead. <laughs> I think Goku is done. Uh, so don't get a super... Perfect. Okay. And SCR Gogeta is at... 5.55. Five, five. <laughs> super effective against all types. The only thing is that for EZA Battlefield Super Battle Road, you will be able to transform with them, but you're not going to have a million turns to build up their attack and defense with all these attacks, right? You're not going to be able to get that. Um, okay, I'm actually going to use... We should be good here. Um, what is your defense? Okay, with Great Saiyan Man 1 and 2, his defense is through the moon right there. And this is going to be a Dokkan attack. This is going to hit so damn hard. All right, this will be a two-turn buff uh, for the Great Saiyan 1 and 2. Not bad, not bad. So he's going to take double-digit di damage here. I would love to see how much damage he would take from UI Goku after Gogeta super attacks. Um, if only we could get the additional... I, I think I probably will prioritize additionals for both of these units. I mean, it, it's really hard to say because, you know... Vegito Blue doing the two super attacks no matter what is really awesome. You know, getting multiple crits is great. But, like, really getting that second additional super for him or, you know, for Gogeta, his first additional super would be absolutely, like, huge, right? And remember, you know, that is building their stats up and stuff like that. Like, hmm. Oh, my goodness. That's so much damage. On S I wish he would have supered right there, man. Ugh, that would have been so good to see. Yeah, Gogeta, this is not going to do too much to blue Gogeta. Yeah, 89k, that's that's nothing. From SDR UI Goku, that's what I like to call nothing right there. That's that's not bad whatsoever. All right. Um, I think I probably do want to get one more of the ultimate Kamehameha or full force Kamehameha, and then we'll probably finish up here. I don't know. Maybe just this last turn. Can we get full key for Gogeta right here? I think we can. Um... Okay, so we'll go Blue Gogeta first right there. Boom. 
Yeah, okay, so that's the other thing too, right? So they gain 1p every time... Is it they do an attack? Yeah, so Gogeta gains 1 key every time he does an attack, right? So he gets an extra 5 key. Then on a rotation with 2 over and a flash units, also units with Fuse Fighter, he's not going to struggle with key. But compared to, like, the LR Super Saiyan 4s and stuff like that with their key management, right? Where they get all this extra key from Rainbow Orbs, Blue Gogeta does not really have the same. Again, from what I'm seeing, I think I like Vegito better. Because the guaranteed two super attacks at blue, that, that's that's powerful. Even Kale and Khalifa don't always have guaranteed two super attacks, right? Even LR, Gohan, and Goten don't always have two guaranteed super attacks. Vegito has two guaranteed supers per turn, which is just nuts. It's absolutely just nuts. And, like, look how fast we're just tearing through the Legendary Goku event with this. Like, we're at... 16 minutes and we're against SCR UI Goku. Like, just absolutely, like, ludicrous. Um, wow. I don't know. So, I, I definitely need some more time to play around with these units before I could definitively say, like, oh, best units in the game. But I I think they might be better than Kale and Khalifa and Gohan and Goten. They might be. They might be. Again, y'all gotta give me a little bit more time with this. I, I need to see how well they're going to perform, like, in all these different modes. Um... Like, because Battlefield, you're not probably going to transform with them. Or you'll transform just as the fight is ending. Um, you know, so stuff like that is a bummer. 4.19. <laughs> Alright, let me know what you guys think of Gogeta and Vegito. Uh, as of right now, I think I like Vegito slightly better. Because the, sec the, the the guaranteed second super is huge. Um, they're, I think, bare minimum. Their units, the best, they're the third best unit and the fourth best unit in the game at the bare minimum. But I think it's probably more likely that they are 1 and 2. Let me know what you guys think. Thanks for watching. And I'll catch y'all next time.